Putbar Salu, India Songni Vice President Jagdeep Tankar, Shilong Songjan Maonari, Bain Ba Megalaya Skill and Innovation Hub na Pangchakaniko Songyo Nangaha, Aruyana Pangchakaniko Songanyo Megalaya Dokni Governor, CH Vijay Shankar, Skotong Minister Conrad K. Sangma, Aru Health Minister Amparin Lingdo Badong Pai Bakrangha. Ya Absan Salona, Songni Vice President, CM Business Catalyst, Student B Planning Challenge with IIM Shilong Koba Bachingatio Nangaha, Aru Adoko Badang Chiwala Niko Tangduat Nagata, UNDP Bak. Sana, Megalaya Sorkarini, MOU Osoi Kagarganyoba, Dumpaha. Ya Megalaya Skill and Innovation Hub Co, New Shilong Ni Ekar Dog Point, Sotbonga Briong Gapao, Gong Kro Sotsni Sni Point Bonga Koro Shangchirken, Aru Ya Biap Koba Dung Chiwala Ni Dung Tang Dung Tang Kamrang Baksana, Chadam Beran Kotari Suna Gataja Kalangen. Ya Pangchaka Niko Songyo Nangan New India Songni Vice President Jagdeep Dunkar, Jin Managan Prakangingun. Sadam berang ni canga sapan yang kau ni rok sandina, aru nam dapat nagta, deng tang deng tang kamrang kau, abah cengat tengah nina, aduk ni chief minister konrad kesang makau macam pelang ha. India songo cuba serang pak presiden ni kam kau, tribal match kan jakor enga, aru megalaya toko DGP ni kam kau bas kang pak cangna tribal match kan jakor enga ni gman. Yan India song ni dat luaran yo deng tanga ni kau mesok enga nebadan kar akan ha. It was a delightful moment for the entire country. When we had Madam Drupti Murmu as our president, the first tribal woman to occupy such high office, I must share my joy that we have amongst us a bureaucrat, Ida Ashisha, Nang Ram. The first woman DGP of Meghalaya and the first tribal lady from Meghalaya to be DGP. These are twin credentials define changing profile of India's growth trajectory. As chairman Rajya Sabha, I was in the chair when reservation was made for one third women to be in Lok Sabha and state legislatures, distinguished bureaucrats, and most importantly, boys and girls. At the outset, let me extend an invitation to two categories. I will request the Honorable Chief Minister that in batches, I would invite students to be my guests at Indian Parliament. New building of Parliament. Megalaya Doko Skill and Innovation Hub ko kuliyan yara badang siwala ni kamrang ko tang duwata niyo dakchakan yung gen na iyan na pati ngon. Ya center ko kuliyan ni Chia Doko Kamka Gaparang ko babang pati yung katat na dakchakan yung gen na Vice President akan ha. Unfolding of the infrastructure reveals that its size is going to be gigantic. Will attract attention beyond the state. But human resource involvement would also give cutting edge. I would particularly request the Honorable Minister for Skilling Government of India, Sri Jain Chaudhary, to have deliberations with the Honorable Chief Minister and the team. He is a dynamic minister with independent charge and has already revealed his mind by way of two very important articles. So the kind of passion I saw in the Chief Minister, the mission mode which he reflected, the execution for which he is known, I am sure this is going to be a real boon to the youth because these are the times where skilling is no longer a quality. It is our need. It is our daily need. It was equally delightful to launch CM Business Catalyst, a student B plan challenge. That was amazing. I was a student of physics, not of chemistry. But I learned over the years that catalyst is something very important. You have to catalyze the change, you have to bring about the change you believe in. 
Someone has to take that step. And that step was taken by visionary Prime Minister Narendra Modi 10 years back. So no one is more informed than I am about the situation of the country in 1989 when I was a member of parliament and a minister. How shaky we were on economy, how fragile was our foreign exchange balance, and what was the mood of the nation. Prime Minister thoughtfully by visionary steps has uplifted mood of the nation to one of hope and possibility. An ecosystem is in place now where every young boy and girl can look for a larger basket of opportunities. Must be just getting into government service. And I am therefore particularly enamored the innovation, which is our obvious forte, and skilling for which we have to be global source center. 